Most of us think compulsively all the time. That is to say, we talk to ourselves. If I talk all the time, I don't hear what anyone else has to say. If I think all the time, that is to say, if I talk to myself all the time, I don't have anything to think about except thoughts. And therefore, I'm living entirely in the world of symbols. Therefore, if you meditate for an ulterior motive, that is to say, to improve your mind, to improve your character, to be more efficient in life. You've got your eye on the future and you are not meditating. Well, meditation, when correctly done, has nothing to do with all that. It's a kind of digging the present. It's a kind of grooving with the eternal now. The place where it's at is simply here and now. If you simply close your eyes and allow yourself to hear all the sounds that are going on around you, just listen to the general hum and buzz of the world as if you were listening to music. Don't try to identify the sounds you're hearing. Don't put names on them. Simply allow them to play with your eardrums. It's all just sound. And if I am talking to you right now and you're doing this, don't try to make any sense out of what I'm saying because your brain will take care of that automatically. You don't have to try to understand anything. As you hear sounds coming up in your head, thoughts, you simply listen to them as part of the general noise going on, just as you would be listening to the sound of my voice, or just as you would be listening to cars going by, or to birds chattering outside the window. So look at your own thoughts as just noises. And soon you will find that the so-called outside world and the so-called inside world come together. They are a happening. Your thoughts are a happening, just like the sounds going on outside. And everything is simply a happening. And all you're doing is watching it. It's all just sound. The place where it's at is simply here.